Hi guys, it's Iris. So this is the finished product for the makeup look that uh, from the tutorial that I just filmed for you guys uh, using some Dollar Tree uh, eye products. I used the uh, Milani Bella Pink eyeshadow and the Bella Purple eyeshadow as well and uh, the e.l.f. Beautiful Browns uh, quad for my eyebrows there. So yeah, this is the finished product of what that looks like. I did this exact uh, look today for work and I was really, really feeling it and I said, you know what, I want to film that as my first tutorial. So yeah, do you guys like it? See, I don't, I don't do any contouring. I don't think I need it because, you know, my face is pretty full and I don't need to be chiseled. So I don't contour. I just use some blush and pop some really nice eyes on and that's all I need. So it is really hot in here. So I am going to uh, pull my hair up while I share with you guys a, uh, gosh, maybe I shouldn't pull my hair up. That looks really bad. <gasps> Who cares? Okay. We're just girlfriends here hanging out, talking, you know, it's fine. Okay, so I don't know who I just channeled there, but it was a little creepy. So I have a themed Dollar Tree haul for you guys today. I know I said I was going to do one a month and I just did a mega haul, but I am not real certain that I'm going to be able to uh, stick with the only filming one video a month. I don't think I can do that. It might end up being like haul every other week or something like that. But anyway, I have a themed haul for you today and that's all we need to be worried about. This one is my time of the month haul from the Dollar Tree. So what I did today after I went, uh, after I got off from work because I actually needed this box today. Um, I went and got just a regular storage box. I've got a ton of these boxes. Um, I actually have my entire nail polish collection in one of these boxes um, and I'm about to need another one because I am uh, racking up on the nail polish so and I was also thinking after as I was packing this box up I was thinking uh, how awesome this box would be for uh, like a young lady who is who is new to this who has just started this for the first time you know, so mothers of, of young girls who may be going through puberty, if you're looking for something nice to do for her, um, this would be really good. I actually, I filmed this video once already, uh, and I didn't like the way that it turned out, and I wanted to do my makeup tutorial anyway, so I did that, and now I'm refilming. But when I filmed this video the first time, I was, uh, I had remembered that there is actually a subscription box called Time of the Month Box that is really the same premise as this. What they do is they send you every month, they send you a box right around the time that you're supposed to start your cycle. Uh, and it's got your, uh, your feminine hygiene products in it, whatever you prefer, maxi pads or tampons, and they'll actually even go as far as letting you pick what brand you prefer. Uh, and then they usually have something in there, like some kind of a treat, like something chocolate or something for you to, to snack on because you guys know that you get some cravings. So uh, they've got something like that in there. And then they usually got like a piece of jewelry or some nail polish or something pretty and fun in there for you as well. So, uh, excuse me. <coughs> Can you by it, guys believe that I made it through that entire tutorial without coughing? And I am four minutes into this video and I had to cough. And that other video was like 40 minutes long. Anyway, so I think that this would be a good alternative to doing that subscription box because I want to say that box is like 10 or 20 bucks a month. And I mean, you could go to Dollar Tree and do pretty much the exact same thing for far less money. For far less money because uh, if you're staying stocked up on your feminine hygiene products, which is the most expensive thing, that uh, you don't even have to pay for that every month if you're staying stocked up because usually a regular pack of those type of products usually lasts you two or three months. So anyway, let's just go ahead and jump into what I put in my box. The, uh, the hygiene products that I bought are brand name and therefore since I got them at the Dollar Tree, they are 
trial sizes or travel sizes. Uh, for instance, I'm sorry, I moved a lamp in here so that I could film this video in yet another spot. Uh, so there's a little bit of a glare. But uh, they had these tampo tampox, Tampax Radiant Tampons. There's three of them in here. So like I said, this is just a little travel pack. I do not skimp on my feminine hygiene products. I have to have brand name. I cannot get a no name brand. Not completely. I can go to Target and get like their knockoff of like the, the maxi pads that I use because I use the always uh, ultra thin with wings and I use the overnights all the time because I'm just paranoid about stuff. So uh, yeah, like I can use the, the Target brand or the Walmart brand of that, but that's about as far as I can go. This particular thing, I have to have a brand name. I can't, mm -mm. I can't stray from that. But anyway, there's three of them in here. Um, so like I said, a nice little travel size. This would be good too if you're traveling. Um, you know, maybe a weekend trip or something and you think you might need this. This is good to throw in your, uh, your overnight bag or your, uh, or your purse or your, your suitcase. So I have that there. Uh, there is also another trial travel size of the Always Infinity, uh, maxi pads. There's also three of them in here. Um, really, I just got these as a backup to put in this box because I already have, I'm throwing tampons at you. Uh, <laughs> I've already got some of this stuff uh, in my cabinet right now. So this is just a backup for, because I'm telling you guys, it never fails and I don't know how it happens, but it never fails in, after this go round, if I didn't have this, I would be completely out and it would sneak up on me and I would be like, oh crap, I don't have anything. How am I going to get through this? So really I just have these for backups, but I really just wanted to show you guys that you can get some of this stuff name brand at uh, the Dollar Tree if you prefer it. So there is that. You can, if you don't mind, you can get larger packs uh, of whatever brand it is that they sell at Dollar Tree that's like an actual full size pack of them but like I said that's not something that I like to really uh, skimp on so skimp scrimp whatever I don't like to I don't like to mess with that so there's that um, also some leave for those cramps my dears because you know sometimes those can be killer um, there's only six caplets in this box which I feel like I might have gotten taken for on this because uh, Normally, like a regular size bottle of Aleve is what, like five, six bucks? And I got six caplets for one dollar. Didn't really think that one through too well. But again, not bad to have on the back burner. So, got that. Um, also, this is something new that I tried today actually because. Uh, without getting too much in detail. The first day for me, I have cramps like you would not freaking believe. It hurts so bad. And this is new for me. Never had cramps before in my life until after I gave birth to my son. Since then, that first day just kills me. It is terrible. So, I mean, like, not like I can't go to work kind of terrible, but I'm not happy about it. So anyway, I uh, had seen somebody else say something about using these for their cramps, and I actually used one of these today, and it, it doesn't it doesn't do a bad job. I uh, I can dig it. Uh, so yeah, these are just the uh, Assured brand uh, hot patches. There's two in this pack. They also have the ones that only have one. So make sure that you're looking at that because. They're the same price either way. You can get one for a dollar or you can get two for a dollar. Why would you get one if you can get two? So unless they're out of the two pack and you have to get the one pack, get the two pack if you can find it. Because, I mean, that's just being smart, right? So, yeah, got that. Put it right on, on the spot wherever you feel the pain. That's where I put it. Uh, and it worked pretty good. So there's that. Uh, 
Also, I've been looking for this stuff for a long, long while. Uh, ooh, my uh, overheating thingy just turned on, so excuse me one second because I'm going to unplug that for just the remainder of this video so that I don't overheat my phone. Uh, anyway, I've been looking for this stuff for a while. This is the, uh, I don't know what brand it is. I guess it's Relief. It's the brand. I don't know. It's made by Blue Cross Laboratories, which is kind of scary. But uh, this is just uh, some lavender scented Epsom salt. I used to use this for my feet when I worked retail. My feet would hurt so bad at the end of the day because when I had to dress nice, we had to be fashion forward, which usually meant wearing heels that are not great for standing in all day. Uh, so yeah, even wedges, like at the end of the day, I would be like, those dogs would be barking, baby. So I would just uh, fill up my tub a little bit with some Epsom salt. Uh, but this is good also for your cramps. I know some ladies also, you know, they feel it in their entire body. Their entire body, they're, they're, they've got muscle cramps everywhere. They just feel like poo, just absolute poo. So this is lavender scented. I love lavender. If you don't like lavender, they have um, just plain Epsom salt, but Epsom salt is really good for muscle relief. Uh, I'm not, now that I'm looking at it, I do know exactly what it is. Uh, Epsom salt is good. It's got magnesium in it. And magnesium, I just learned today from our reflexologist at work, uh, most people apparently are magnesium deficient. So uh, she was telling me today that she, uh, she's been having really bad cramps in her hamstrings. So she actually got some magnesium that's a spray. And when her legs cramp up, she sprays her entire leg with that uh, spray magnesium and your skin absorbs it. And as soon as her skin absorbs it, that muscle releases. So, because your muscles need the magnesium. So, that's why Epsom salt is good for cramps and any soreness that you might have because it's got the, uh, the magnesium in it. So, and it's also lavender scented, so it smells nice. So, you can just run you a warm bath or a hot bath, however you prefer it, and sprinkle you some Epsom salt in there. Let it take the pain away and just relax and know that everything's going to be okay at the end of it. Uh, also, I got some chocolate because who doesn't need chocolate? Me. I don't really need chocolate during that uh, whole ordeal. Uh, I will tell you, <laughs> you cannot put what I want in a box. Uh, you could, but it would get old and nasty very quick. I want all the fried things. That's all I want. Like, I am not kidding you. I could have today actually for, on my way to work, I did actually stop at Sonic and get me some French toast sticks. And let me tell you, that was an experience. It was the best freaking thing I have ever put in my mouth. And I've had French toast sticks from Sonic before, but something about having a craving for something and actually getting to eat it. Oh, yes. But I could have gone back a second time today and, and loaded up on like cheddar poppers and cheese sticks and tater tots and french fries and anything fried and delicious can get in my belly right now because that's all I want. I don't even care about chocolate. I just want all the fried things. But I did get some chocolate because it's a time of the month box. You kind of, some most people need it. And actually, by the time I got home, my husband, my, my husband, <laughs> my son, <laughs> whoo, my son had a box of M&Ms and he gave me some, uh, because he's a sweet little baby. Uh, my battery is running low now that I unplugged it, excuse me, while I push the button on the screen. I'm pushing your buttons. I'm pushing your buttons. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> sorry guys. Uh, yeah, my son gave me some M&M's and I was like, oh, now I really want chocolate. So I'm glad that I got all this chocolate. I got me some peanut clusters because you can't screw those up. And I got these because I also got these, uh, these tiramisu flavored, uh, tiramisu flavored filled dark chocolates. And this is by the brand Lama or Llama or whatever it is. I've been seeing these 
and all of my Dollar Trees down here for about two or three months now. And I keep wanting to try these and I haven't done it yet because I'm just really scared that they're going to be nasty. Uh, but I went ahead and bought them anyway and as, as backup and old standby, I got me some peanut clusters. Um, let me tell you a story about peanut clusters. My mom loves chocolate covered peanuts, but not just chocolate covered peanuts, double dipped chocolate covered peanuts and also the peanut clusters. Loves them so much so that that was one of the things I was forbidden to touch when I was a kid. You didn't touch mama's Oreos and you didn't touch her chocolate covered peanuts. You just didn't do it. So, and I'm sure she knows that I did this, but I would get home from school and I would like go to the fridge. She kept them in the fridge all the time. Go to the fridge to like find me something to drink or a snack or something and I'd see those, those, uh, those chocolate covered peanuts in the fridge every time they'd always already be open. They weren't open, I knew I couldn't get away with it. But they'd be open and I would actually count to see how many peanuts were in that bag so I could figure out how many I could get away with eating without her noticing. <laughs> but I don't have to do that anymore. I can buy my own chocolate. So I don't know, that's just a little nostalgic memory I've got that I wanted to share with you guys there. So. Anyway, that is my time of the month box. Like I said, um, moms, maybe this, you know, if you have daughters, maybe this is a good idea for you. Uh, if you wanted to put together a box for your, uh, your daughters every month, you know, you don't even have to do a new box every month. You can just, you know, make a box up like this and put the essentials in there. Go ahead and stock up on the essentials so that you can put those in the box. Um, and you don't have to repurchase those every month. And then just put in, you know, a couple of really you know, put her in some some treats. Put her in some chocolate or some some kind of junk food that she likes in there. And you know, go to the Dollar Tree and and get her that and some cute nail polish or you know some hair accessories or something. Just something little fun to make her feel a little bit better. Cause you guys know it, that makes you feel lousy. It really really does. So yeah, I just thought this was. A really cool idea so I wanted to go out and do this haul for you guys so I hope you enjoyed it if you did give me a like uh, I would even like better if you would hit that big beautiful red button down below that says subscribe and subscribe to my channel that would make me so very happy um, yeah so this is the finished look from the tutorial that I did earlier this was my Dollar Tree uh, time of the month haul so I hope you enjoyed it I will see you guys next time Bye!